Are you planning on presenting this to the public, like seminars or something like that, when we did the various uh, projects before? Yes, it would be when we have something to present, because right now it's merely just a thousand thoughts floating in the air, and that's what part of this money would be used for, is to bring it to something that could be envisioned. Um, what we're talking about is using a portion of the money to actually uh, develop 3D plans where people could see what they would be buying. What would the complete street look like? Mm -hmm. uh, this is in an effort to get the business community in that corridor to understand and to buy into the project and also for the voters to understand. Uh, like for instance, when it comes to appropriating that 1.5 million, if they choose to do so, uh, what, what it would be used for and what the end result would be. So, yes, there, there, there has to be more uh, outreach. I would think so, but just as starting off with the 300,000, I've seen many uh, plans before in Hampton where they spend a chunk of change on planning and we never did do it. So I'm reluctant to be enthused about the 300,000 without any public exposure whatsoever until this point in time. I think we, it's a little late. It's like the train has already left the station as far as I'm concerned for this year on this issue. Well, I mean, it's kind of late to try to come along and say at the last minute, oh, by the way, we got this wonderful plan. Great. Well, that's wonderful, but I think the public needs to be informed on that plan. And I haven't seen anything until just tonight. Well, as I said earlier in my comments, is that when the water company finishes doing what they're doing, and we do the sewer, and I redo some of the drainage because I'm dealing with some corrugated steel pipes that may be in their corroded state or not, there won't be one table square of pavement that's untouched. So I have to do a full width pavement. I have to um, make it right, make it look good, make it look better than it presently does. I've got some sidewalk deficiencies down there. So. Um, given the amount of work that's going to go on in that corridor, I, there's no way possible that this would be a uh, boondoggle or a waste of money or time or effort. Uh, it would actually make the project wrap it up tightly and make it come out better in the end, in my opinion. But, Mr. Nines. Yeah, go ahead, Chuck. Can I, can I, can I, can I, 